Happy Monday, Gators. I hope you had a nice weekend. Today is Monday, April 27th, 2020. I'm Mr. Duschel, your IB coordinator, joining you from Washington, DC. Today, my co-host is Mrs. Wong. Good morning and welcome, Mrs. Wong. Good morning, Mr. Duschel, and hello, everyone. Ms. Wong, can you share with us some birthdays that are happening today? Today, we are celebrating Gabriel R. and Christian A. in Mrs. Ford's fourth grade class. We are also celebrating Pavel H. in Ms. Wu's fifth grade class. Happy birthday to those Gators. What else is special about today? We have some interesting celebrations today, National Prime Stick Day and National Silence Day. And as I thought about what I wanted to share with everyone today, I couldn't decide between those two. So I chose to discuss about something far more important, the idea of creativity as we stay home during this time. Art is something that is very important to me. It provides me inspiration and I use it to inspire others. Mr. Duschel is going to show us some art for my favorite artists in a virtual exhibit. You selected Vincent Van Gogh as your artist. I too find him to be one of my favorite artists. Luckily, we can see some of his work virtually. We can see here that this museum in Amsterdam has shared some art with us. If I scroll down here, they have collections, many images of his work. But I wanted to show us this online exhibit about the books that Vincent van Gogh read. I love the idea of knowing that Vincent van Gogh really appreciated books as well as art. And his artwork is beautiful. Why do you like his art so much? I think his use of color and all his paintings really bring about movement, the way he is able to create textures on the page. There are so many virtual online exhibits for you to explore, and that's why Mr. Duschel and I wanted to show you this today. Thanks for finding that, Mrs. Wong. Let's see what else we have on our agenda for today. We wanted you to think about how you can be creative. Here are some ideas for you. These ideas are great. I've already done some while I've been home. I think it's a wonderful opportunity for our Gators to also demonstrate their approaches to learning and the PYP transdisciplinary skills. Ms. Wong, can you wrap it up for us today? Have a magical Monday, Gators. Regardless of how you show your creativity, remember it's all about self-expression and having fun. See you next time. Thanks for joining us, Ms. Wong. Have a nice day.